guys, what's up? It's Megan. Today I'm doing a quick video about how to build your subliminal playlist for the best and most importantly, the most quickest results that you can get from subliminals. And this is important because a lot of people actually don't do their playlist the right way. And that prevents the subconscious messages from subliminals from actually manifesting in your life or actually doing anything for you. So this video is gonna be talking about how to do it and the mistakes and things I've seen in other people's playlists that are kind of inspired me to make this video today. So I'm gonna show you an example of a playlist that is so jumbled up, meaning there's different topics and they just quickly go topic to topic. It never stays on one topic long enough for the subliminal to actually be incorporated into the subconscious mind and to actually start to work on a person. This playlist is an ADD type of playlist, I call it, because it's just jumbled up. See how the topics aren't sorted, they're just put in randomly. It's going from get bigger eyes to get bigger lips to getting clearer skin. So none of these are related and you're just jumping around in this playlist. It's not a bad playlist, but it's not going to give you the best results that you could get. They who sent me this is complaining about how they're not getting results and the main reason with this playlist not giving them results is because these are such short subliminals, they're only like a couple minutes long, and if you just listen for that long to a subliminal and then you jump to something completely different, you're not giving your subconscious enough time to be rewired and to be basically hypnotized and changed in habits of the new ideas and the new things that the subliminal is giving it. So what I do is I break every single playlist down from each topic. So if I was doing a topic for getting smaller ears, I would put only getting smaller ears subliminals in that one playlist. And then I would have everything else in my other different playlists and I wouldn't have to like combine that because you just listen to those playlists separately. And what that does is it gives your subconscious mind enough time. So you would listen to a playlist for maybe like an hour or so, and that gives your subconscious enough time on the same affirmation. So just break your subliminal up into these different groups. And when you break your subliminal into different groups, you're gonna have a lot of different playlists that are probably smaller than your main big playlist. But that's okay because you just listen to those smaller playlists as often as you want. And by doing that, you're giving it more energy to each idea into each topic. Some people recommend just waiting until you manifest an actual result and then moving on to the next result. I don't recommend doing that. I don't think you have to do that. I think it takes too much time to be waiting for a result. It can be like a long time. So you can definitely do more than one thing at once with subliminals. But for the most part, if you're just listening to a jumbled up playlist where you put random subliminals in back to back and you don't really look at grouping the subliminals into their own topics, you're not gonna get the same amount of results in the same quickness of time if you did this method where you're just placing them into separate groups and separate ideas. So also people ask, well, how do I know if a subliminal topic should be grouped together and think of it like you're writing a book so if your subliminal topics are similar in the idea that they would still go in the same book together then you could just put your subliminal topics in the same playlist safely boom 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 one after the other because your subconscious needs to be basically hypnotized almost and with a hypnotist, remember, they repeat everything over and over again. And a few minutes of one subliminal isn't enough. And it's not gonna make any type of changes if you're doing it super fast like that. So that's my biggest pet peeve with a bad subliminal playlist is it just goes from topic to topic to topic. I hope this video helps. And if you guys wanna hear more from me, my name is Megan and I talk about the amazing benefits of subliminal messaging all the time on this channel. And I also have an Instagram, it's at MeganXRose that you guys can follow and hit me up if you have any questions or just wanna chat. Love you and stay safe.